<laughs> Who's bothering me on disco? That was Carl. Uh. Sorry, that's someone asking me about an Ogapon. I gotta see a guy about an Ogapon, which is not something you'd expect anyone to say, really, but. Is that because you wanna take the Ogapons away from me? Yeah. I mean, they're mine anyway, but. I know. I know. <laughs> Uh, Milky, if you're still there, thank you very much, dude. Let me know. No problem at all. I don't know why I'm scared about putting that in the active. I just put it in the active. Okay, so this is Dengo. The question becomes, what is the better play against you now? This is... Not a great start in hand either. This is one of those I wish I went second kind of hands. Why are you making me pick a grass end? You just. just... Yeah, that's the reason. Yeah, like. Yeah, doesn't solve nor not solve anything. Um, I, I guess that's the turn. Yikes. As a Yu Gi Oh player, I'm. All too used to BMs, people will have 10,000 damage on board and it's like bro stops summoning, I only have 100 LP. I had it early with uh, Festival, like I was close to decking out, well I was pretty much decking out, I had nothing else and all my resources had been burnt. And uh, they still carried on playing like I had anything to do and they were like, I was like, awesome. So when I passed over with zero cards left in deck, all they had to do was pass back and they would have won. They just performed their entire turn, so I let them do like four or five actions and then concede them. Like, they just don't get the prizes then, if they don't just take the knockouts. Deck out with your neck out. That's funny you should say that. This, this deck has a long neck, boy. Hi, Grotful, how are you? <laughs> Speak of the devil and he shall appear. Uh, let's give it a teal dance. Yes. Welcome to the stream. <laughs> Okay, that's something JPEG. Uh, let's, get, yeah, let's get rid of one of these. You love one of these? Um, God, this is such an awful hand. And then I guess we'll go Grasping Draw. I need to find out how people are playing this deck because I don't know if I'm playing it right or not. <laughs> At all. I've not tested. I've tested Roaring Moon, but I've not tested this deck much. I'm really not sure because when you run Cleffer, it's like, do I choose to go second? But you're playing a V Star deck, and V Star decks love going first. They're one of the few decks in this crazy world we call Pokemon. Still want to go second, so it's just bizarre to me. We're going on so far. It's fine. I'll snap it, Dango. But yeah, if you're looking for people to uh, deck out with their neck out, can I introduce you to Raging Bolt, the long neck boy? Look at him. He's so cute. Good, because I'm having a terrible one. <laughs> well, attack's a strong phrase. There are no energies in this house. Okay, so we need to see some good cards here. I said some good cards. I've no idea. That's something you should take up with your rabbi, I guess. It's because you have my box out to take my deck away. I read your wallet. <laughs> but where's the rest of my deck box? But where is my deck? I don't know, it'll be somewhere. We'll figure it out. We're allegedly smart people. My god, is this really what it's coming down to? <sighs> Come on. We're just digging for, I want to say glory, but like, I've yet to see any glory. Hey, there we go. Right, so, get rid of Bingus and Bongus. 
grab ourselves one of you. One of those! Reggie Drake. Reggie Drake. Nope, Reggie Drake. <laughs> trying to evolve the right Pokemon. Good job, buddy. Well done. You got this. Full face. It retreats into you. Attach, and then we go Legacy Star! Get rid of all of the deck. Uh, who do I want back? What's your bag for good? Give me that. I think we're in more of those. I should be okay. The energy switches do, in fact, go hard. Okay. So I think... What are my options? Oh, this is one of those, do I go greedy or not, please? No, we don't. Um, we go Apex Dragon. And we hit him with a Phantom Dive. <laughs> Why? What did I do wrong? What did I do to deserve this? Hi, Alto Beans. How's it going? Welcome, welcome. People BM so bad in Yu-Gi-Oh that you end up winning unwinnable situations by time limit wins. <laughs> God, that sounds horrible. Hello, Beansy. How are we? Just hit Ultra League with Ogapon Sinatra and was rewarded. Now working on a water deck for the dailies. Hell yeah, dude. I'm all good. Thank you for asking. Um, did some testing with Roaring Moon EX earlier. Turns out that deck's actually still pretty good. Um, but yeah. I don't think we've got anything too exciting going on today. Uh, went, went to Asda instead of Aldi for our shopping today. It's pretty fun. Until I nearly got sideswiped by some dickhead who teleported, quite frankly. Looked to the right of the junction. Looked to the left of the junction. Saw it was clear. Went to go. Honk! Some twat had sent it up from, like, the bottom of the road. And was, like, honking at me. And to be fair, yeah, probably should have double-checked. That's fine. I appreciate that. Probably should have. Should have, would have, could have, etc, etc. But, like, you were steaming down the road, my dude. That is quite the gap to cover from the main road. So I wasn't happy. But it is what it is. Uh, Reggie Rago just auto-wins me when I play Lost because just, they just spam Noivern EX. It's so true and based. Roy Moon is lovely. Do you have any water suggestions that are not Chen Pao? None that are good. Uh, <laughs> but you could go the um, Kingdra Hisui and Basque Legion route. I don't have a list, but I was playing against one earlier, and they got a lot of water attacks off, so if that's what you're looking to build, like for water attackers, that's probably the way to go, I would imagine. Huh? Did you try it? Turb Turbo Roaring Moon? I've seen some decks and looks fun, wondering if I should play it. Uh, I played earlier, I played five games, and I had a great time with all of them. I only lost one game, and that's because I misplayed. And that was against Festival as well, of all decks. Also, I found out that Hisui and Basque Legion is very good in Ogapon and Sinastia. Yeah, I imagine it is. Um, is there a... Um, oh, there's a... Grass... Is there a Teal Ogapon? Or a Sinatra that uses, like, energy from the discard and puts it back into the active? Am I going crazy? That's a thing, right? Or is this guy going crazy? Uh, yes. You'll never believe what happens next. It's actually a really awkward prize map here. <laughs> now that I've done that. The gamers would argue there was a better way to do that. Who are the gamers? Turbo Moon was awesome in Paradox Rift, but it felt clunky after rotation. Yeah, I used... So, between January and rotation, I I didn't exclusively play, but I played almost almost exclusively. Like, 90% of games, especially in real life, were Rory Moon EX. And I love that deck. It took me to a cup win. It took me to very close to day two at Liverpool. Uh, it took me to an online tournament win. Like, I really enjoyed that deck. And this new version isn't quite the same. Um, losing Moltres is actually massive. But I think it still does pretty well without it. Like, having a uh, baby Roaring Moon in the deck and three EXs kind of makes up for the shortfalls a little bit because you've got a, a two energy attacker 
rather than exclusively three NG attackers. So it's good. I, I quite I quite like it. So one ninja was broken, I guess. Yeah, dude, like it, the, the list I'm running runs the water NG and the canceling cologne and the NG switch. And it's really good. It's won me games. Genuinely won me games. It's so good. So good. What? While I played it as well, um, especially at Liverpool, most people had taken their water energy out of the deck. So they were just running like eight dark, I think it was. I was still running like seven dark, three water. And I was just absolutely destroying the place. I had such a good time. Like Greninja in that deck is so broken. Wait, you're at Liverpool Regional? I think I, think I saw you there. <gasps> was I in a good mood or a bad mood? <laughs> I was mostly in a good mood, to be fair. Like, I was so close to the team. It's it depressing. Yeah. Well, there's a, I mean, there's lots of Yeah, someone who actually knows me, IRL, uh, got me mixed up with somebody else who had a shorter beard. I was like, okay, well, <laughs> I guess I'm just not that popular. <laughs> uh, Hauke, thank you very much for the follow. Very much appreciate it. Please raise your do doos and tutorials in chat for Hauke. GG. Stop, stop BMing, fist 